Hello and welcome to La Liga. Today it's Elche against Osasuna. Your commentary team, Martin Tyler and Alan Smith. Alan Smith alongside me, Martin Tyler, and a big welcome to you to this match. Alan, what do you make of the home side here today? Yeah, they'll take this, Martin, mid-table. It's what they probably expected at the start, although they would probably see hope for better things. But uh, when you look at the squad and compare it to ones around them, it's probably where they belong. It's a very wet day today, and that will have some effect on the conditions. The positional play of this play is really good. Flag went up straight away, referee blew offside. Very tight game between these, between these two on the home ground of the team that's the visiting team today. I wonder whether it will be similar today after a goalless draw, but I'd be surprised looking at the talent on view. Yeah, they don't normally get two games the same, and as you say, there's, uh, there's enough players out there to break the deadlock. Tackled well. Ruben Perez. Wasted possession. He got really tight, the defender there, and snuffed out the problem. But that was quickly done. Corner given. All oh, his nerves were jangling then, that defensive player. Carlos Sanchez. Attack here. Goal! Shot doesn't get. Goes for goal! A shot making the goalkeeper's job pretty routine. Interception. He committed himself in. There wasn't much cover, but he got the ball, the defender, in the wide position. Attacking now. He went in well. well. We all look at the referee, as the players do. Is he going to decide, Pedro Ortegia? The referee's reached for the red. Well, in this day and age, you just cannot get away with those kind of challenges. Cross from that side, and the defender read it well, to be fair. And the ball's gone out for a corner. And in comes the header. Great reach by the goalkeeper, and he's caught it as well. shot there and that's why it's so wide of the mark he's checking back on the stats for the visitors Alan six points from their last five league games it's not over impressive is it no it's not and, uh, they'll look back on those five games and think of where they could have done better much better challenged quickly by the opposition Arribas Santos, Cejudo, could be dangerous, who goes in, and 
seen a reasonable run. The last five league games, we tend to look at that. Eight points. Not set the world alight, have they? But they've slowly accrued those points, and uh, maybe at the end of the year, they'll be seen as, as good points. Carlos Sanchez. Oh, he's let his team down there. Really shoddy defending. Santos. Here's the chance. That's the, that's the block. Cejudo. Oh, yeah. Well, they've been uh, thwarted here. That's a sign of better things to come. And the added time will be, time will be four minutes. Del Moral, Sanchez, Sanchez. The opposition back off, they could be in trouble. The ball gets to here. Good defensive play here. Stopped emphatically and just as well. The approach play looked very encouraging. Taking up their positions now to deal with this corner when it comes in. And he heads it for goal. It's in. Brilliant header. A goal here to Sabre. Well, it was a, a really accurate corner and a fantastic finish by the ball. So after the goal, we've opened the scoring here. 1-0. the ball well it's offside and the referee's given it well, that's half time at 1-0 we heard the reaction from the referee as he made his way off the pitch at half time because of that red card that he showed and it's a shame from the match's point of view but the ball is moving again for the start of the second half great passing Crowd really enjoying it. Manu Del Moral. Ruben Perez. Oh, yeah. Manu Del Moral. Oh, he's climbed well to head the ball away. Oh, yeah. Chance for him. He takes the shot. Good stop by the goalkeeper. He's held on to the ball as well. Dino. Miguel Flavio. has sent the ball over the touchline. Oh, yeah. Showing it's a physical game when it's a fair one, too, and that's a great challenge. One, one possession back with that tackle. Some players limbering up for the away team. Substitution in the offing. Sanchez. Manu Del Moral. Chance here. Oh! And the shot's called the goalkeeper into action here. He's done well. Goodness, they needed him then to clear that. Ruben Perez. And up went the flag. Offside given. Free kick. 
It's a tactical substitution for the losing team here. Carlos Sanchez. Dos Santos. Slight tackle came in, but he's hurdled it. Ruben Perez. Got room here. He's cleaned up here, hasn't he, with that clearance. Options available on the bench for the away side today. Ruben Perez. Tattler has won it very cleanly. You know. That's a difficult situation for the attacker because the defenders just dominated it. Well, there's still time to hit back in this game and they're going to try and do it with a substitute. On to the attack now. That's another successful challenge. Dos Santos. Tried to keep it, but they haven't been able to do that. Oh, what a vital stop. This is the chance. Oh, good reflexes by the goalkeeper. Powerful effort. Let's hit the player and change the uh, mind of the assistant there. They're both fighting for the ball here. That could be the end of the game for this player. He's stopped in his tracks by that damaged muscle, I'm sure. It's been a great game, and there's still a chance for an equaliser here. Manu Del Moral. Well, we might get an update on that injury now from our man Jeff Shrees. Jeff. Looks like he's got a problem with his hamstring. But at the moment, he hasn't asked to come off. And Jeff right up to the minute, as always. In a goal. Goal. Could it be? So little between these two teams. It's been an absolute thriller. These last few minutes should, minutes should be along the same lines. It is the move that we expected from the manager whose team is, whose team is trailing to get an extra potential goal-getter into the bottom to be. Wonderful finish. Well, against all the odds, they've got a goal. This point to great character. They didn't let the heads drop. Got the reward. Well, that has made it two now. There's maybe three minutes added on. Arribas. Sanchez. organization and the ability to stick together they did that and they saw it through well let's get right up to date now with all the classified results thanks martin and alan spanish cup quarterfinal second leg levante nil barcelona one espanol two real zaragoza nil la liga elche two Osasuna, nil. Granada, one. Real Betis, two. Now let's see what effect that's had on the league standings.
At the top of the table remain Atletico Madrid with 48 points. In second, Barcelona with 47 points. In third, Real Madrid with 46 points. In fourth, Valencia with 43 points. In fifth, Real Sociedad with 34 points. In sixth, Real Betis with 32 points. In seventh, Elche with 32 points, but only behind on goal difference. In eighth, Sevilla with 31 points, with a game in hand on the team above. Bottom of the table, Real Valdelid with 12 points, but only behind on goal difference.